Good day my little robins, it's me Beth, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another music video reaction. If you haven't already checked out the title, we are back in Europe and we are back reacting to Visions of Atlantis and the song and the music video Monsters off their upcoming album Pirates 2 Armada which is out at the start of July. This is the second single after Armada which I did react to. I will leave a link up here and probably at the end of the video if you want to go check it out. But pretty much Visions of Atlantis they pretty much hit gold when they released like the first Pirates album, the theme, the concept chef's kiss and i'm happy they're kind of sticking with it and kind of expanding on this lore because visions of atlantis are very much i would say like a concept story group once they latch onto something it kind of goes through like all the releases and the albums but for me i am obsessed with pirates in general so you know i love this direction they are going down and i will continue to support them yes before we begin, if you'd like to support me and the channel in the future, you can by clicking a like to show me some love. You can click subscribe and tap that bell to be notified of when I upload on this channel. Enough rambling, let's just dive straight back into Visions of Atlantis. Okay, let's press play. Let's see what they have to offer. I'm going to turn the volume up slightly. Are we going to get like an origin? Okay, off the bat, visuals, stunning. Oh. I think we are getting like backstory. I love that dramatic headpiece. Dressed in white and now all in black, evil pirates. Oh, look at him. I love his voice. <laughs> the combo of him and Clementine. Angel on the last album. That's what the vibes I'm getting. Like the alternative thems. together for years how good they sound together and also love a solo we all have monsters inside us in the mirror. Ooh, the 
telescope and the headpiece. Ooh, drama. Is that the end? There's still a few seconds left, so we've got credits. I'm not sure if I should end it. Let's just watch these credits and see if there's like any more clips at the end. But that's how you tell a story and like set up like an origin or like lore for like your world. No, I think that's the end. That was the Visions of Atlantis Monsters. Let's talk about it. I'm just gonna say this now because I did react to Amada and I definitely got like Amada was written with like the vibes of performing this live and having like the audience chant along and like more audience interaction. And then with Monsters, I feel like this is like a very like story driven song and like really powerful. It's meant to have like some sort of impact. I'm not sure, you know, if it's setting up a background or like a law for like how these two became pirates because like it appears one's already a pirate, one's not a pirate. But then at the end, once they've smashed the mirrors after, you know, breaking free from the monsters, did the monsters actually come out of the mirrors with them. Because, you know, um, you had the, he had the scope, which we saw in Amada, and she had the stunning black headpiece. So, are they all, have they always been monsters? You know, have they always had this dark side? I did also mention that, like, partway through, I definitely got, like, melancholy angel vibes from, like, the last album. And that's because they were confronting, like, these alternative, like, versions of themselves and they had to kill their melancholy angel in order to be free and so I got very similar vibes with this monster song you know I'm I'm a sucky you know if you want to do some like overlap or you know you want to like do like some synergy and like continuation over because I feel like especially if you're calling the album Pirates 2 it's a part two to your first album so if it's in the same world and the same visuals I'm not mad if there's like a little bit of repetition or they've gone, oh, that was nice. Let's do a little something something here. It works perfectly in the context of like the whole album. I cannot wait for this album to come out. I am so excited. Um, we probably might get one more single. Fingers crossed before the release or they'll literally drop the next like single on the day of the album release because sometimes bands do that. But it'll be really interesting where they go because I, it is like watching a movie with some of these like European bands in general, especially like the symphonic power metal like genre. You are like watching like a whole film or like a TV show with like just how high quality the production value is on like m pretty much the majority of like the songs, be it the two singles we've had so far, the visuals they did for like the album before this, or even the albums that have come before Pirates and Pirates like 2. They do not skimp on a budget and as like an ex-film student and as someone who loves visuals and I just love dissecting music videos, it helps when the song is like a perfect but then it also helps when it is beautiful to watch and I definitely want to watch this um, video a couple more times in, on my own time because I want to like see like when they were in like the rooms like with their monster selves or like confronting the beings there were all these objects and I kind of want to see if there's any links because sometimes you have to watch a music video more than once because you never know what you're going to miss on the first viewing in the comments below. I'd love to hear, you know, your guys' thoughts and opinions on the song, the video, the band. Did you like it? Did you not like it? Sound off. Everybody is entitled to their own opinion here on the channel. And trust me, a lot of you guys are very opinionated. Who would afford it? Anyway, let's get into my rating slash ranking. If I had to give Monsters by Visions of Atlantis a rating out of 10, guys, it's getting an 11 out of 10. They knocked it out of the ballpark so you know it definitely deserves more than a 10 but i feel like amada just because of the more catchy nature of the song i'm gonna spoil it now i gave amada a little bit higher of a rating so but still go check out my reaction but in terms of visuals and storytelling this song is 
this video is, I would say this video is superior to the Amada video, but I think I preferred the Amada song just a little bit more. So do with that as you will. Everyone's entitled to their own opinion. I've already said this. Do not come at me in the comments because if you're mean for no reason, I'm just going to delete your comments because I have that power. Anyway, let's just wrap up this video before I continue to ramble. If you'd like to support me and the channel in the future, you can by clicking a like to show me some love. You can click subscribe and tap that bell to be notified when I upload on this channel. At the end of this video, you can check out my last two videos or playlists depending on what mood I'm in when I'm editing this. Until next time, I'm Beth. Keep listening to good music. Goodbye.